Hello friends and welcome to 3 Minute Game Pass, I'm Nathan, and according to Doom creator John Carmack, stories in games are like stories in pornography. Expected, but not necessary or good. Well, John Carmack may be roughly 10 billion times smarter and more successful than me, but I think he may have been wrong on that point about stories, and today we're gonna prove it. Here's 3 games with great stories on Game Pass. Our first game is Nier Automata, which is a game from the wild mind of creator Yoko Taro, which if you don't know who that is, just look at this picture of him. Yes, he wears that everywhere. Kinda says it all, doesn't it? Well anyway, Nier Automata is a character action RPG focused around the story of androids and robots in an ever-ending war for Earth. The androids fight for the humans who are on the moon, and the robots fight for the aliens who are trying to invade. However, not everything is as it seems, and as the game progresses and you replay sections as different characters, you begin to learn the truth of what is actually going on, and have to decide for yourself if anything you do has any meaning. And I don't mean in the game, I mean in real life. Does anything we do have meaning? Okay, too deep a question for this video, let's move on. The bottom line is that Nier Automata is a game people bought because of 2B's ass and left with existential dread. It's usually one of the best game stories on Game Pass, and one that sticks with you after beating it. It also has the best final boss in video game history, trust me. Our second game is Yakuza 0, though in reality we could probably say it's the whole Yakuza franchise. Switching gears a little, Yakuza 0 is a 100% accurate Japanese gang simulator that blends both serious melodrama and absolute utter insane banality in a way that few forms of entertainment have successfully accomplished. You play as two protagonists, one is an up and coming Yakuza who has been dishonored, and the other a successful Yakuza with his own maid cafe, basically. Both want to rise the ranks of Yakuza and earn respect, and the best way to do that is to impersonate a movie producer, go bowling and slot car racing, hit the dance scene, and play karaoke. Oh, and beat the ever-living crap out of literally everybody, everywhere, all the time. This is also important. The bottom line is that Yakuza 0 is a game I play where one moment I was laughing my ass off, and the next I was genuinely sad around what certain characters were going through in the plot. Never before has a game balanced these two things as well as this series, and Yakuza 0 is the perfect place to start this franchise. A third game is AI The Somnium Files, which is a visual novel, which means the story is the most important thing because you're going to be doing a hell of a lot of reading, and it means I'm probably kind of cheating by putting it on this list, but too bad! In this game as you play as the detective Date from the Devil May Cry series and his robot eye named Aiba, as you try and solve the mysteries of a string of murders happening around town. The game has many branching paths that diverge based on what you do in its actual gameplay portions, which are escape rooms inside the minds of various characters. As you piece together what's actually going on, you'll have to explore multiple plot lines and encounter some downright nutso plot twists before reaching the true ending and solving the case. The bottom line is that AI The Somnium Files is a fantastic murder mystery that has both a great sense of humor and some genuinely gut-wrenching story elements. If you enjoy fun detective stories and wise-cracking anime waifus, this game is for you. That's all I have for you today, make sure to check out the individual reviews of these games on the channel, and I realize now that for some reason every game on here is from Japan, so I guess I'm confirmed to be some mega weeb trash man whatever. Next time, they probably won't all be from Japan, but who knows. Regardless, thank you so much for watching, and go out there and enjoy three games that have some fantastic stories.